Marco, thank you very much for your, your time today. Um, I've been lucky enough to, to see the film. And I think um, one of the huge appeals about the story is that, is that it's, it's based on a, an actual historical event. Is that something that was appealing to you? Absolutely. I mean, uh, you start from something real and then you understand also your position uh, uh, about about that, uh, about what has happened. Uh, what has happened makes you ask yourself uh, some questions. And I believe that is what the movie uh, does at the end uh, of the screening, apart from enjoying or not, whatever, enjoying the story and uh, be moved or not. Uh, but for sure, it's posing some questions. Uh, about yourself, your position, uh, about what is transcendent, uh, spirituality, uh, nature, and also it's a story about human beings and strength uh, and uh, power of faith uh, and, uh, and a message of peace. So all this uh, pushed me to investigate more and to make this movie. And I think because the story is based, it's, it's, it's set in Portugal and it's based on these three children who, who see the Virgin Mary. And I think even though it, it could be perceived as a kind of religious film, it really isn't, is there? There's, um, it's very much a family drama um and also again it does talk about question and it makes us think about our faith um but it also shows the kind of the strength and the 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 fortitude of these three children who no matter the odds they stick to their story don't they absolutely that was the so you really get the purpose so. First of all, of talking to everyone about a religious subject, for sure, but uh, look mo more, I mean, the, the, the vision is broader, it's, uh, it's open to something else. Uh, and if you pay attention, everything could be, every scene uh, could be read in uh, two different or even more uh, possibilities, let's say, I, I'll give you an example sometimes uh, about the lightning. The lightning uh, is not only, it's only Lucia seeing that because the other two kids. So is Lucia imagining everything or not? There is always a plus the structure of the movie with two uh, really uh, skeptical uh, characters uh, like uh, R.V. Ketel and Goran Bisnich. Uh, they pose the question of uh, the not believers that are, uh, but it's sure that one of the things that I like better in the story was, uh, apart from the uh, spirituality, religious side, uh, is the relationship uh, in between mother and daughter, and, and another mother, and the fact that something that big arrived and destroy the. Um, equilibrium that they find inside of uh, the uh, family, inside of the village, and outside also, because this one arrived up to Lisbon that was uh, at the period quite far away. So uh, really changed a lot. Yeah, it's interesting you say that because there is such a build up of momentum throughout the film where it's during World War One. Um, you know, and we see that, you know, members of the village are, are losing their, their relatives to the war. Um, and, and then as, as, so we've already got that kind of sense of drama um, and, and kind of a, this sort of sinister backdrop of what's happening in the world. Yes. Um, and then as the story, as the story unfolds, this relationship between the mother who's already in a very fragile place because her son is at war and not knowing whether he's dead or alive. He's at war. It's, it's at, exactly. He's at and the front. You, and, uh, and, and then you've got this, this the, her daughter who she can't believe is the chosen one to see this vision. And, and I think the relationship and the, um, 
the, the way that their relationship unfolds is a really quite remarkable and the acting is is really quite remarkable between the the pair of them isn't there the mother and daughter uh, i love playing a lot with actors that's for sure in uh, in not only in fatima but in every is one of the parts uh, that i like uh, better uh, um, to to i mean the change because i was a dp and uh, the change in between a dp that works with the images so tell a story through images so this part overlap with my work as a director but the, the the things that i like a lot is to build characters to work with actors to shape every single expression line and everything and stay there to to, to make a real three dimensional uh, a character that serves the story, let's say, uh, and and I really enjoyed very much with uh, Lucia Moniz, uh, the three kids, uh, all of them. I mean, uh, Arvi Keitel, uh, Sonia Braga. I, I loved all the cast, and I loved playing with that. Um, going to the other side uh, of the question on, on the previous part. Uh, I think that uh, for me, the, exactly the human side, but it's, it's the two sides that comes together because the Virgin Mary arrived in a moment where the, the war was crazy. It was 1917, it was a few years that they were fighting, a lot of deaths, uh, poor, poorness everywhere. So there were a lot of frustration uh, and Portugal, uh, strangely enough, from, because it's a Latin country, eh, was anti-clerical at that period, really anti-clerical, uh, because it was uh, a newborn republic uh, and they want to follow ideas uh, coming from the French Revolution. And, and so um, they didn't like the idea of, be, of the population being so connected to religion and uh, um, and they were pushing to a big change inside of uh, the population. So they have to learn how to write. And, and this is also a message that comes to say the Virgin Mary, peace, stop this madness, uh, otherwise something bad will come and it's the Second World War. Uh, so I think that the two things, the two parts, uh, the religious side and the human side really mixed up in the story. And I think it's, it's the power of the story is also this one. Absolutely. I think the irony, isn't it, as well with the story is that the, the Virgin Mary comes to, to, to these, to the, in a vision of these children and then to, to bring and to talk about kind of world peace but it actually brings a conflict closer to home, which is between the, 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 the mayor and the secular thought of, of, of the yes. town and, and the religious um, and the Catholic side uh, of the town. And I think um, it, that's quite ironic, isn't it? Absolutely, absolutely. Luckily, it was only a fight, but not a war. Absolutely. <laughs> Ar arguments and all that stuff, but they didn't really <laughs> arrive to something more than that. Uh, but sure, every time there is a division, but at the same time, uh, in, uh, I think that uh, was, uh, even the other side, the secular part, they really, uh, they were there at the miracle of sun. And if you see the description are exactly the same, the scientists, journalists, and the description of believers are, same, are the same. Uh, there is one of the biggest newspaper of the period and the editor was there and he wrote, I say, I'm a journalist first uh, and I will not change. I'm not a believer. I will not change my mind, but I have to tell you what I saw. And if you put together the description, one nearby the other one are exactly the same. That's, that's incredible. And, uh, and the story is... Um, it's almost told into in like there's two separate stories, isn't there? We we kind of set the story up Harvey Kite with Harvey Keitel as the 
cynic, I suppose, speaking to Lucia, who is now a, a nun and wanting nun. to hear her story. Um, and then obviously we have Lucia's story um, told to us. Was that interesting for you to create, um, kind of sets the story up. So you've got the kind of um, the more, I don't want to say cynical, but um, skeptical point of view. So that represents one audience's um, point of view. And also, um, you know, the, the, the nun, Lucia, who still has faith and, and, and is resolute about that. So we've got two representatives of, of two different audiences that can enjoy the film. Absolutely. Uh, this, this was, let's say, the purpose, but one, one of the purpose, because the other one is uh, to see the story at distance. Uh, because when you are inside, even, even in, in the old story, 1917, so with little Lucia, there is a skeptical and a part of the village, the mayor. Uh, so I didn't want to show only this side because this side was also in the previous part of the story. I mean, in the old part of the story. The other one is to see what is happened with, this, with the filter of time. So with a certain distance, instead, instead of leaving it, it's okay, let's look back at the past. And uh, with all this year that has passed from that moment and you change, uh, that you were only a kid, how do you see? What was your experience? Uh, what, um, how important it was for you, for the world? Uh, what you regret, you don't regret. Uh, so it's not only... Uh, something to, to, to show the point of view of the skeptical, uh, but it's uh, illuminating the other story, I believe. For example, the, what is uh, uh, the, what I say about the iconography, well, not me, I mean, it's Harvey Ketel saying, so, but I, put, I wrote this, the, the line, so I know what, I ask him to say the lines. Uh, it was very important, not only for the part uh, uh, in, in between uh, Sonia Braga and Alvi Ketel, and so the old Lucia and the, and the professor, but also to say why she sees the hell in this way, because she sees a painting, is, is the vision of, of that she has of the uh, hell is exactly the painting that she has of the hell in uh, in her church. So it's a, a, everything tied together. Uh, in something about the iconography and how much the iconography can uh, in, uh, influence our judgments uh, in uh, and uh, inspiration or, and everything. Do you, as, as well, imagination. Um, sorry. No, that's okay. inspiration was imagination. <laughs> and you've you've worked as as you said as a as a director of photography, you, and also um, making you know documentaries. You've been a, a camera op for that too. So, do you think that background as well has given you um, another kind of analytical eye and a, and, a, and another way and a an influence has influenced you really to to be as kind of authentic and as truthful to the original story as as you can. No, I think that uh, for sure the experience as DP, director of photography, uh, helped me to have uh, tools to to tell the story. So, uh, and to use it to achieve uh, uh, what I want in the sense of uh, emotion, uh, uh, exactly arrive where I want uh, uh, with the image. Uh, it's like writing. Uh, if you know how to use the grammar and the dots and commas, uh, uh, then you know how to express yourself better. But uh, I, I don't think that... Uh, I really like to start only, not only in this subject and, uh, and work on that, not changing, not inventing too much because I don't like, I think I respect, I think that we find enough 
in the reality that we don't have to invent so so much is uh, you adjust the reality sometimes for the arc uh, dramaturgic arc uh, but i don't push it uh, because i think that we have to respect it. and and that's what i try to uh, on this movie i i try to respect the different points of view, including mine. And having, for example, the nature as one of the character, main character of, uh, of the movie, the, the beauty of nature where someone uh, uh, gifted as uh, Lucia can see God. Yeah, absolutely. And, and but also a not believer. And not believers as well. Eh? Not, it doesn't you don't have to believe to see? I mean, the, the beauty that surrounds us and uh, and enjoy that and enjoy some moments as uh, Lucia is enjoying uh, when she's uh, in the hill with the flock and everything. Yeah, and and I mean, you have to. You've definitely uh, achieved that with the film. It's it's very respectful and it's a, a beautifully character driven drama uh, and um and my time is up with you unfortunately marco so i'm gonna have to i like this expression i like your uh, and uh, <laughs> i think it's that it's not it's not only a religious movie it's a religious subject it's a spiritual movie and it's about uh, character uh, drama dri driven by characters yes Absolutely. i think so 100%. i agree completely Go and see it. Oh, I can only I'll say, be, please I'll be go plugging and see it. it. <laughs> Enjoy. Thank you very much. And all the very best with the film. Good luck. Thank you.